political leaders, our uh, business leaders, our utility company executives have to address the changeover to clean energy sources and it'll probably come from abroad so it probably will happen fairly fast. I'm not really concerned myself about a radical shift because people seem to be on the verge of readiness for change. A lot of fear but also some positive anticipation and maybe it takes an unraveling of what we have to put together a cleaner, more sane world. Is mankind ready? Do we have the maturity to handle it? Are we giving matches to a baby? That's, that's the question. Well, the first answer is we're kind of backing ourselves against the wall. If we maintain the status quo, we're doomed anyway. It looks like we're going to get a shot by having this energy available to us. If we're not mature enough, to handle it, well, I guess we're doomed either way. We have a chance to survive, a chance to go on, but it will take, in a way, a consciousness transformation, understands their consciousness movement and things like that, that people are starting to wake up. It's not just a me game now, it's a we game, and as we learn to work together and have empathy for one another, we can transcend the old selfish consciousness, which has caused all the problems and all the wars and everything else, into a recognition that we are a planetary being. We've only been able to present a handful of inventors and their remarkable devices in this program. There are hundreds, if not thousands of people worldwide, scientists, engineers, entrepreneurs, who are actively working right now, researching and developing this phenomenal technology to the point where it can be successfully scaled up and mass marketed. We are at a pivotal crossroads in human history. Can we as a society release our fears associated with the violence of the past and embrace the unknown? Can we cast aside our rigid skepticism in favor of an open-minded spirit of inquisitiveness? Our very survival may depend on how we answer these questions. We hope we've given you enough of the necessary information with which you may base your future decisions regarding this exciting new field, one that will soon affect all of our lives and the very fate of our planet Earth as well. I'll see you at the finish line. The race is on. If you were fascinated by the amazing technologies and concepts you've just witnessed, now you can get even more valuable information and details from the new energy series. Five full-length videos, nine hours of in-depth conversations and demonstrations of free energy systems. Explore the worlds of inventors and theoretical physicists who are changing the paradigms of science. Volume First one of all, features Tom Bearden. 
in particle physics, any electrical charge is automatically a broken symmetry. Now what this means is there is a virtual photon flux, a violent flux exchange between the vacuum itself, which is filled with this virtual photon flux. Volume two, John Hutchison. I feel that that is also true. I think the Mayan connect is also a uh, coherer of frequencies and transmit them out and then lock this doorway into space and time. This motor here drew 12 and a half amps. Volume so three, Joseph Newman. This motor right here only draws seven and a half amps. And look at the size of the propeller. Look at the size of the propeller. Look at the size of the motor. Look at the size of the motor. Now this is exactly what I teach throughout my book. I taught it to Dr. Hastings. I've taught it to the world, but the larger you make the mass, then the, the smaller amount of power it will take and the more power it will produce. With Volume 4 highlights prototype. Troy Reed. This is an old mechanical device. It's got, it's got two inner wheels on the inside and two outer shell wheels with magnets. They got eight magnets on this side, eight magnets on the inside here. Let's see what kind of torque we got at 75 PSI. And Volume 5, need? Dennis Lee. Okay, here it goes. <laughs> maxed it out so it went all the way off the end of this thing 150 foot pounds of torque by this engine they're just 29.95 for each tape now the process or get here, all five for 119.95 a savings of 30 dollars place your order cycle. today just call 1-800-795-TAPE t-a-p-e a right to lightworks audio and video post office box 661-593 Los Angeles, California, 90066.